Hello my friends, my name is Mohamed Naveed in this lecture I am going to teach you file menu in Adobe Photoshop. So what I do first, first I will come here and then I will click on file and I will get all the options of file menu. First option is new. So what is the work of new? With the help of new we can create a new document. So what I do, I will click on new and as you can see that right now we have all the options for, for a new document and if I say okay this options or this width or this height is fine or after this what I do, I will just simply click on ok and I will get a new document. So in order to get a new document, what I need to do, I need to come in file and I need to click on uh, new and I will get a new document. Then we have the option for open. Let's say if, if I have completed my work and if I want to continue my work or let's say that okay yesterday I was working my, on, on this project okay and uh, okay and if, if, if I want to continue my work so definitely I will not click on create new because definitely I don't want to uh, st start from beginning definitely I want to continue my work so what I do I will click on open and definitely I have to tell me where my file is and after getting that file if I will click on it and if I click on okay so definitely I will get my file here. And if I want to open any uh, picture, I can also open a picture here as well. Uh, browsing, definite bridge, we can also do definitely open as. Let's say if I want to open as, means if I click on open as, so here we have the option, means if I want to open this file as a definitely as a PSD file or for example is, uh, for example as a, uh, as, a JPG, as a JPG, getting me. So if I want to open any file, uh, definitely with any, uh, with any uh, extension, I can also do it. So if I say uh, open as, so definitely I can also definitely open any file with definitely as a, as a PSG file or definitely JPG file. Uh, open as a smart object, definitely, uh, definitely if you want to open any object, a smart object, you can also open. If you don't know what basically smart object is, so you should watch my video on definitely a smart object, definitely in layers menu, I thought you that uh, definitely what uh, smart objects are so if you if you want to learn more about smart objects so you should watch my video on smart objects uh, then uh, definitely here we have the option for definitely open recent uh, so right now showing me all the recent pro uh, project I've opened uh, here we have the option for close if I just want to close this uh, window so uh, definitely I have the option definitely if I click on this cross so I can also close or if I come here and if I click on close so I can also do and if I want to close all my uh, projects I can also do uh, definitely uh, save if I want to save or save as so what is the difference between save and save is the difference is that if I say save if I click on save and if I give the name aside this same name is fine if I click on ok and if I, if I click on OK, as you can see that now, definitely I have saved my document. Now if I want to change, uh, let's say if I, if, if, I, if I want to change the location of my, uh, d uh, of, of my file, so how can I change? If I come here in file, in file menu, as you can see that this option has disabled, you hear me? So uh, if, if I want to change the location of my file, if I want to save my uh, my file in a different location so what I need to do I need to just simply click on save as and definitely with that of save as I can change the location means now I'm able to change my uh, m my file in any location getting me so definitely this is the difference uh, between definitely save and save as if it's a save definitely it will be safe and if I want to change the location of my my, uh, my file and if I want to save in um, uh, my file in different location definitely I will click on save as and definitely save as will allow me to save in different location uh, then we have the revert what's the mean of revert if I uh, take th this text or any text getting me as you can see that right now I have this text and uh, if I come in definitely file so if I take another okay it's fine and if I go in file so here we have the option revert so what does it mean a revert in easy word we can say that if you want to go back if you want to go one step or two step back so how can you go back if I come in file menu and if I click on revert so as you can see that now we don't have that object because definitely before we did not have getting me so if I want to go back so I can go back with the help of this option and if I want to export this file quick export as PNG means if I want to export this layer as, as, as a piece definitely I can also do 
or if I want to export definitely anything so with the help of export I can do means if I want to export what does it mean export means that if I have something in Photoshop and if I want to out something from or, 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 from the Photoshop so what I do I will click on definitely export and here I have the all the options for export uh, definitely here we have the generate if I want to imp uh, generate Im imp uh, image as I can also do shame behalf I can also do uh, search uh, Adobe stock means if I want to know that what is the new in Adobe definitely I can also do F place embedded and place link definitely we will learn this definitely in, in the next lecture uh, then we have automate definitely here the option scrape import what is mean import means uh, uh, the uh, the difference between export and import is that if we say export means we are out, we means we are uh, definitely we are we are saying that okay from from uh, for, from Photoshop we are we are for example throwing something out getting but let's say if I uh, if I say import so let's say that if I have something outside of my uh, Photoshop and if I want that thing inside of my photo uh, for my Photoshop so what I do I will click on import and I will get something inside in Photoshop getting me so if I want to get anything so I can get if I click on it so here we have the option means if I want to import notes I can also do from fair that I can also do file information if I click on file information so means I can give uh, information about this file means who's the author uh, who's the author of this of the, this file author title everything keywords everything I can give here uh, then we have the option for print if I want to get the print I can also get if I want to get one copy I can also get and if I want to exit all my Photoshop so I can also do. if I click on uh, exit or if I come here if I click on this uh, big X so I can also do getting me so this was lecture on file menu in Adobe Photoshop I hope you have understood for more videos lecture and exercises come to my website www.navithpress.com I love you and I will meet you in the next lecture. till then Allah Hafiz